Hey guys, how you doing? This is Coin with Collapse Gaming, and we are here for the uh, final part of episode one for a new frontier. But uh, you guys know the drill. I'm just gonna jump right into it. The series doesn't really involve me having to say too much, just because it's such a big storyline and it's all like dialogue situations. But yeah, here we go. It kind of hurts. I'm sorry. I know it sucks. I'm... I haven't been sleeping well lately. I've noticed. So many people died here. So many ghosts. Sometimes they're all I think about. Especially during the night. Ghosts don't scare me. They don't have teeth. Or guns. Yeah, I guess. Hey, look, Goofball. It's you. Alvin Goofball Jr. Can you say Goofball? <laughs> you know, he does need a middle name. His parents, they never got a chance. You think? Go on. Pick one. No time like the present. How about Lee? He would have loved this little guy. I was just thinking Jamie was pretty cool. For a boy or a girl. Jamie? That was your sister? Yeah. I used to think that if I was ever... picking out names, I'd... Anyway, the deal was ink first, then a perimeter sweep. But I just checked it a few days ago. We're on our own here, Clem. And after that asshole family we let in made off with half our food, we can't take any more chances. It won't take long. They seem nice. Nice enough. Nice people get hungry too. And then suddenly, they're not so nice anymore. So get to it. I want you to be prepared. For anything. I know. I'm gonna go take a little nap. I'm, uh, not feeling that great. Huh. Jane? If you're not feeling well, I can bring you something. Oh my god! Damn. She was pregnant. Damn, that's fucking brutal. to uh, Alvin Jr. I suppose we'll learn more about that later. Hey, Clem. We almost there. Hey, Clem. Yeah, we're close. I gotta say, I hope your people are safe and sound. 
Eleanor asked me before we left to make sure of it. Oh, yeah? Yes, sir. So that's what I'm gonna do. Though why she went to bat for you, I've got no idea. I mean, she hardly even knows you. And you don't know her, for that matter. No, there's not much mystery to a trip. She's a good human being. Yeah. Eleanor's got a big heart. That's for damn sure. Guys, that's the place. Oh, shit. What a mess. Jesus. Must have been hundreds of them. Kate's good in a crisis. She'd know how to get shelter. What's that? God, you're safe. I can't believe it. You told me where to hide. I just listened to what you said. Lock yourself in and don't come out, not even once it's quiet. It kept running through my head like on a loop. You did exactly what you should have done. I always knew you were a smart kid. Thanks. It was scary at first, but once the muertos couldn't see me anymore, they just passed by. Kate and your brother, where are they? We got pulled apart when that huge bunch of muertos showed up. Kate yelled that they were going to try to make it back to the van. And that's where we're headed. Let's go find your brother, sweetheart. Oh, no. No. No sign of him. They must have seen it like this, then gone someplace else to hide. Kate. Ariana, stay back. Nice. <laughs> Took care of him quick Javi, enough. you found us. Hey, hey, it's okay. I got you. You happy to see me? I'm happy to see all of you. Happy you're all okay. Another couple of minutes, we might not have been. But then, you showed up, just when it really mattered. Yeah, well, that's kind of my thing. Oh. <sighs> I wanted to come after you. I swear I did. You don't have to snot all over my shirt about it. I thought we were dead. Like, never gonna see you again dead. We only had a couple bullets left. There's no way I would let that happen. Yeah, well, you weren't here. The herd showed up and Mariana was gone and we were waiting and, and waiting and then... I was just so scared. I'm here now. You don't have to be scared. Hey. You hurt yourself. You must have scraped it in the truck. Didn't even notice. Hey, at least it's not a bite. Well, not much we can do about it here. I've got a lady friend who's a doctor. As soon as we get back to Prescott, she'll patch you right up. I'm Trip, by the way. Pleasure to make your acquaintance. We should be getting back. Don't want to push her luck. Who's the kid with the gun? She have a name you want to share with us? Or are you going to make me do my own introductions? Clementine's a friend. Hi there. Glad I was able to help. Well, we're very grateful to you. Really. There's a town nearby. It's safe. I like the sound of that. Oh. 
Oh my god. Javi, do they have hot water? Even like lukewarm water would be okay. I think so. Right, Trip? <laughs> well, I guess you'll find out. <laughs> I thought you'd been to this place. I have. I just... I didn't have much time to relax in my jacuzzi suite, you know? Between you and me, these kinds of missions don't usually go so well. But you found every single one of your people. And you found them alive, healthy, reasonably cheerful. And well, let's wait to celebrate until we're back behind the walls, okay? I don't want to jinx us. Well, some things are worth saying woo-hoo about, that's all. When we get back to Prescott, you still owe me a working ride. I haven't forgotten about our deal. You couldn't have known what happened to your van, but still, I need some way out of here. I was hoping you might stay. You know, considering... Considering what? You came all the way out here with me. Yeah, for the van, not for... Cool. Forty-seven point one percent of players chose to head back out on the road. Uh, did you shoot the driver? Let him go. We shot him. Of course, a lot of people got locked up. Who doesn't want to help Clementine out? Trip, which is probably a good option. Stayed with Clementine. Oh yeah. But uh, all right, 
right, guys, you know what to do. Like, subscribe, share this with all your friends, and uh, leave a comment down below because I like hearing from you guys, and all that stuff really helps out the channel. But, uh, yeah, guys, I'll see you guys next week in episode two. But uh hope you guys have a great day, and I will see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching, everyone. Bye. I smell too much. I drink too much. I tell myself.